way. Tony, Thor, what's your status? There are mortals trapped. Lots of small, angry men with guns. Uh, I just caught a bus. Maybe I should have had a bigger breakfast this morning. Civilians trapped behind those barricades. Understood. Stay behind me. I will deal with them. We got you, Thor. This should be fun. Thor, who are we dealing with here? They did not introduce themselves. Hang on, those guns are shield issue. I'll get Commander Hill on the line. Cap, they picked today for a reason. Agreed, Bruce. I'm staying with the Chimera until we figure out what's going on. <laughs> Is on the way. Just got confirmation. A shield convoy was hijacked this morning. 
This from one of Fury's morning briefs I never read? Come on, Tony, those are important. Okay, whatever. Pulsar rockets. I'm glad Fury kept all my best tech in one place. Those rockets are doing a lot of damage. Yeah, I know. I built the damn things. Cap, already on it. Tarleton's heading down to the reactor chamber now. Stay behind cover. All right, which one of you B-movie extras shot at me? Avengers, the convoy is carrying classified shield prototypes. Fury is tracking down the full manifest. Oh, how's the cat? Oh, tell Fury I really love being shot at with my own weapon. We'll keep you updated. Reduce is fine. Ah, I didn't know you were listening to that part. ship's not ready for flight. Why is it moving? Someone's initiated the security protocols. The Chimera's autopilot has taken over. You'll need backup. We're heading back. Negative. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get into the city. Copy that. You're up, Bruce.
clubs. Funnel cakes. Focus, Tony. are dangerous, Stark. Hey, those weapons were meant for the good guys. Is that supposed to be a joke? Not the time. Get your heads in the game. Cap, what's going on over there? Not sure, Nat. Seems like the reactor's malfunctioning. I'm getting strange readings on the monitors. Like we're being pulled to a heat signal in the bay. Down! Repeat that, Cap. I'm having trouble here. Nat, do you read? Report!
hear me, the convoy is transporting a highly lethal sonic disruptor bomb. Our enemies intend to detonate it within the city. We're going down. I repeat, a sonic disruptor bomb. Secure the asset at once. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Thought that you and outlawed those years ago. Let's have a look, shall we? <laughs> now that is an entrance. Taskmaster. We need to get that detonator. That bomb goes off. It could liquefy everything within a 10 mile radius. Well, what are we waiting for? Aren't you? What are you gonna do with it? Sell it to the highest bidder? 
I'm after something much more valuable. What's that? I won't spoil the surprise. Trying to piece it together? You giving up? Not a chance! <laughs> so, where has your investigation left you? That you're not the brains behind this. And this smells like distraction. I'm done talking! <laughs> Coward! What's the matter? Don't like surprises? <laughs> Next time, take better notes. What are you talking about? Look around, Romanov. The world will remember this day. The day their heroes failed them. <laughs> Five years ago, the Avengers paraded dangerous, untested technology causing damage on an unprecedented scale. Our beloved Captain America was killed during the attempted theft of this technology. Thousands of other innocent people died, and many more still bear the scars of what has come to be known as A-Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strange cocoons, only to emerge with dangerous, otherworldly powers. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country, and while both S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Avengers promised to rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought about the end of an era. You so-called heroes transformed San Francisco into an infectious, gas-filled quarantine zone. You unleash diseased, powerful beings that wreak havoc throughout our nation. Many still lay dormant, unidentified. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Their activities outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day, but I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. Comforting words to those families torn apart by the disease. But is he too confident? Many criticize AIM's tactics. This so-called resistance army grows stronger every day. This is Phil Sheldon reporting live at the A-Day anniversary. I can't see the revolution right under their noses. Come on, where'd you guys go? There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Hello there. If you get it right, copy everything. We'll find you. Now we're talking. 
Oh, Retro Stark. Do you have a moment to talk, Beta? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. <laughs> the girls are leaving for the mosque retreat in a couple of hours. It's still not too late to meet them at the bus. It was tonight? Kamala, we talked about this. Going to the retreat will be a good time to get away from all of this. Breathe some fresh air, laugh. Nakia will be very disappointed if you don't go. You're right. I'll think about it. Good. Very good. There'll be ice cream, eh? <laughs> oh, and best of all, no boys, so lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Beta. I love you more. But you don't get it. <sighs> okay. Where were we? Password hint. First love. Hmm. Oh. What's... What? Oh. Come on, Kamala, you got this. Oh, right. Dang! Come on, go. No way. I can't be it. Go, Tony Stark. <sighs> no. No, no. No, no. Oh, right. I know I got something. Better check this out at headquarters. I really kicked the hornet's nest. Gotta get to headquarters and check out what's on the splash drive. 